sugar canes that we've oh. actually traced back to the first Polynesians that came to Hawaii. Wow. Um, so they they brought with them all of their food staples on their canoes, um, like taro, Hawaiian sweet potato, alena, cookie nuts, sugar cane was also one of those crops. So they just brought those over and started cultivating these crops here in Hawaii. Yeah. So this is the Paca Valley. Okay. This is the okay. resembles the colors of a fish, right? It's beautiful. Yep. Which is the this is the cane variety that was used for the dagger right. uh, That was going to be my next question. Yeah, for the, the dagger rum is this cane variety of Paca Valley. This one looks very Dr. Seuss. Yeah. It's like a zebra, I like it. Are you gonna cut out a cane? Yeah, she's gonna totally cut out a cane. Oh, pretty cool. Yeah, that one's cool. Are it you looks like Dr. Seuss. Sure that's okay. Yeah. What are you doing? I don't want you to get a cut. <laughs> <laughs> you, guys, you guys just grew this, all this stuff, and you're gonna cut this down some. We try to only leave like two. Oh. So that it keeps growing. Yeah. Which one do you want? Get the nice one. Though. <laughs> yeah. yeah, which one do you want? The colorful one. The colorful. Oh, those I'll show you. Are. Oh, that's cute. Oh, Look at that. That's a big one. Oh, you, what? Are you serious? <laughs> yes, it's young. like in North Shore. Oh. Like, go out and get, go, <laughs> right. go out and get oh, some right. cane. I'll carry it around with you. Welcome, <laughs> <laughs> Rob. Yes. So this is a pocket valley made out of that dagger, the dagger yeah. club Kila. Explain to them what the, the story. What, what so the story behind the pocket valley? Or the yeah. Kila? So, <laughs> so the story behind the Paca Valley, there's not really much of a story actually, oh, but it was named after a reef fish uh, known as the, like a rainbow wrasse. Okay. So it had the same coloring and markings as the sugar cane. Um, so there's like a handful of Hawaiian canes that were named after different fish because they looked similar. So, but you can see this is like super fibrous. Full of juice. Yep. Um, so if you so chewed on that, it'd be sweet. Yep. Yeah. I'll just yeah. put a little. Yeah. You want a piece? <laughs> no, I just scraped it with my fingernail. <laughs> video. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Some are used for like love ceremonies. Some are used for like spiritual ceremonies. Some are used to sweeten poisonous concoctions to yeah. kill you. <laughs> so yeah, they were used for each one. So in our collection, we have 34 different varieties. To sweeten poisonous concoctions to kill you. Yeah. Like so, that, so that you didn't know that you were being poisoned? Yeah, I was like, give me yeah. two, like, this is my ring. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the rainbow is over there, too. So get me oh, yeah. Get oh, get the full business. Here we go. Look at that. I'll take a picture because you're, you're doing video. I'm I am. Picture. <laughs> Airdrop. Thank you. Oh, what is that? Oh, you're filming. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Yes, it's pretty good. So hot. So this is our very first one. That's the four of that one. Oh, wow. That's cool. Sweet. So the only ones in the world, um, coal, coal wood is um, very expensive. Yeah. It's a dense endemic wood here in Hawaii. Uh, it's what the Hawaiians used to make, they would use one whole trunk and hull it out and make their canoe out of it. So um, nowadays you're not going to find whole trees that large.